What's up, you all? What is going on? We are back. We are here. This is a video by Fern called Mapping the Trump Shooting. It's like a lot of drama and whatnot going on with the uh, with the Trump shooting. I have no clue what has occurred. Um, yeah, but we about to go ahead and find out. I know he's still alive. That's about it. It's the 13th of July in Butler, Pennsylvania. Former U.S. President Donald Trump speaks at a rally. It's only days until he plans to accept the official Republican nomination. He's just minutes into his speech when shots are fired. Take a look at what happened. <laughs> Trump. What? Are fired. Take a look at what happened. Girl, you sitting there with your phone. Hit, but survived. Someone tried to assassinate him in broad daylight. Here is how it unfolded. How do you know how it unfolded? I got By questions. The time this video is published. New details might have emerged. It's suspicious. It's a hot, sweltering early evening as tens of thousands <laughs> gather here to see Trump. Pennsylvania is one of six vital swing states that will help secure Pennsylvania the is next ratchet, so election. I ain't never Butler going back. Butler <laughs> is heavily Republican, and it is a blue-collar town. Ciao, the re never mind. This ain't about Pennsylvania. This is a big crowd. This is a big, big. It doesn't surprise me he got shot here. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. If it had to be any state, if it had to be any any place. It 100% would have been in Pennsylvania. Ghetto, be ghetto. Most are sitting or standing in front of the stage. Tell me all. Some sit on the bleachers, center, left, and right. This is not Trump surprising. Trump staff and security, including Secret Service agents, are right at the stage. Behind him are three large buildings. On the roof of the building on the far left and on the far right are Secret Service snipers. They are constantly scanning the surroundings, looking for threats. Okay, so how did they the sniper get him? Filmed by yeah. a crowd member. Butler and hello to Pennsylvania. I'm thrilled to be back. Trump begins with his speech. Things seem normal. He turns to the right and points at a chart showing statistics on border crossings. At the same time, several people in the crowd notice a man with a gun on the roof of a building close by. Where? Yeah. It's too late. Take a look at what happened. All of a sudden, bullets start oh. flying. One even gets captured on camera. Another building, oh, about 400 if feet, he was a, north of the stage. If he was a millimeter back, that would have been it. And it looked like he barely survived by turning his head to look at the screen. The shots are coming from here, on the roof. The gunman is 20-year-old Thomas Matthew Doesn't Brooks. surprise me. He is armed with an AR-15 semi-automatic rifle. I know people are saying that this look is some fire. type of like staunch Republican First, or something like that. fires a round of three shots. Take a look at what happened. Oh my Trump god. reaches up with his hand. The first bullet pierces the upper part of his right oh ear. Oh my god. How did no one behind Trump get shot, though? We will later say that turning over to the right at that exact moment prevented the bullet from hitting him right in the head. He ducks yeah, down behind the podium. It did. Within three to four seconds after the first shot, Secret Service agents swarm the former president and shield him with their bodies. Crooks opens fire again immediately with five more oh. shots. Oh. Right before the first shot by Crooks, one of the snipers on the left roof behind Trump seems to detect the gunman and prepares to return fire. Prepares? Some outlets report that these snipers killed Crooks, while the Secret Service can- What do you mean prepares? Why are you not immediately shooting back? It's who who trained these shooting. snipers? We could not corroborate that it was in fact these specific agents. The gunman also hit spectators on the bleachers. Oh. One man died. 50-year-old Corey Comprador. Oh, no. Two others were critically injured. With Trump's microphone still on, we can hear the tense exchanges mm. among the agents. About 42 seconds after Cooks opened fire, they confirm the shooter is down. This is crazy to escort him to an armored vehicle. Come on, sir, come on. Let me get my 
Let me get my shoes. I got you, sir. I got you, sir. Let me get my shoes, sir. Hold that in your head, buddy. Let me get sir, my shoes. How did your shoes come off? Let me get my shoes. Okay, my shoes, Watch out. Watch out. What are you worried about your shoes? Wait, 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 wait. In about 75 seconds after ducking to the ground, Trump raises his fist. He is mouthing the words, fight, fight, fight. The resulting photos immediately travel around the entire world. They are fired. The crowd yeah. starts to chant for the former president as he leaves the stage, bleeding. Trump is then rushed to a hospital. Later that night, he is flown to New Jersey. He appears to be well. Bitch, you left Pennsylvania and went to New Jersey? New Jersey club? Trump, child. There are a lot of questions we don't Why have are you going to all these other states? Why were the forces unable to prevent the attack? Analysis on X suggests that at least Analysis the Analysis on X? By Tim McMillan, who is this? Even the donut. We're likely scouting for dangers further away, with this rooftop possibly falling into the responsibility of other law enforcement agents. We were unable to corroborate that. Why couldn't our men climb up on this building? What was Crooks' motive? The gunman had no criminal history in Pennsylvania's public court records. The New York Times found a voter registration record for Crooks. It shows that he was registered as a Republican. Yeah, they this also is all found I knew. that he donated $15 to a liberal voter turnout group through a Democratic donation platform in 2021. He was a kitchen worker and had a membership at a local shooting club. Mm. The FBI found suspicious devices in both his car and home. They are being evaluated by the agency at the time of this recording. The investigation is ongoing and new mm. information is being published by the minute. President Biden and various leaders around the world condemn the attack and political violence at large. The picture of Trump, bloodied but defiant, with a raised fist in front of the American flag, will surely become a powerful symbol in his re-election campaign. Mm. Interesting. Um, yeah, <laughs> I need a lot more information. That did not help, my, that just actually made me more confused. Mm.